guys, just want to show you a quick uh, ground station that I made. Uh, this is made out of a broken tripod. Uh, the top ball bit is uh, broken so that's why I'm using it. Uh, but it comes in quite handy. Uh, as you can see I've got a 7 inch TFT monitor on here. Cost me about £25 delivered. Uh, I've put a little uh, timer that I don't really use anymore. put it there in case uh, I have someone, uh, someone else watching like a spotter or something. Uh, it's you've got your fat shark cable here, so that plugs into the fat sharks, which gives you your uh, signal and gives you your picture. Uh, and then I wanted something on the back so I can hold the battery. So this is just where I, I hid all the connections and things. It's not very neat or anything, but you know, once it's closed over, then it's it's not too bad. Uh, so I'm running that off a free cell lipo, which is currently on charge there. Bit overkill, it's a 4,400 milliamp, but you know it's just one I had spare, so that's the one I'm using. So that simply sits in there, Velcro, I put it in, connects with Dean's, close that over, and I'm done. And that's a little uh, ground station. So yeah, it is good if you've got a, a spotter because they can uh, also watch through this and uh, through the screen and watch uh, with, with line of sight by looking up at it because uh, their eyes will adjust quicker. So yeah. Um, also, if you've got say you maybe you're doing some shots for somebody, um, you've got the fat sharks on they can't see. So this way they can see and that you you know you're getting the shot that they want. You can line it up or they can say go left, go right, whatever you want. So uh, I don't tend to fly using this, uh, I haven't actually uh, flew anywhere else other than in the garden with it, I've just done a quick test which I'm going to show you now. So uh, yeah that's it guys, just a little quick one on that, uh, I'll have a couple more videos up soon. So I'm going to show you some uh, test footage from it now, it'll also show you when you get breakups on the screen and that because some people are buying FPV and then a bit worried that when they're flying the, the, the picture's breaking up but that's totally normal that's due to the 5.8 gigahertz not trans uh, penetrating through objects properly and that so uh, yeah I'll cut to that video now
Oh, 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 oh,